Okay, uh, what are we up to now? Tarzan and Chug Chug. So, uh, Tarzan stands on the cliff. Tarzan has a mass of capital M. Uh, Vine has a length of L. L and the cliff he stands on the beginning has a height of H. Uh, Tarzan, this is such a bad drawing. Tarzan swings down. Here's Chug Chug at the bottom. He grabs Chug Chug and then they swing up to the top of another cliff with a height of little h uh, to save Chug Chug. All right, so, um, wow. So let's start with uh, all answers in terms of given parameters in G. Let's see. If Tarzan steps off the cliff holding the vine, what is his speed just before he reaches Chug Chug? So this is just a potential energy thing. So we're going to start with, uh, I'm going to call my, at least my first two states, one and two. So initially, uh, state one, Tarzan has potential energy. Oops, let's see, Tarzan and... Earth gravitational potential energy is m times little g times big H, and kinetic energy is zero. And then when he gets down just before he reaches chug chug, his, ah, I hate that, I always put tails on my big U. Um, potential energy there is zero, which means kinetic energy, uh, which is one half big M V squared is equal to this. So blah, 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 E mech one equals E mech. Two, so emac one is this plus this. Sorry, big M G big H. Nothing here. Plus zero. Fine. Equals zero. Plus one half. Big M V. I suppose I should call this V two. Oh, oh wow. yeah. What the hell? V two uh, square. I could have called it U. Whatever. Okay. So V two squared is going to equal. Uh, 2g big h so v2 equals square root 2 little g big h and there you go so that was part a i believe okay uh b tarzan grabs chug card they cling tightly together what's their speed just after they meet so that means over here tarzan's grabbed chug chug now there's one big uh uh chug chug tarzan mass so Let's see, uh, right, so right beforehand, this is a conservation momentum, okay? So conservation momentum, it's an inelastic collision. Um, so it's very easy to just say, let's see, the momentum uh, at stage two, and I'm defining, I know this is being silly, but I'm defining positive x that way because I feel like it. It's just easier because it's all positive numbers, okay? So, uh, sorry, P, momentum there is Tarzan's mass times his velocity right before, and at state three, the momentum is Tarzan plus chug chug mass all times whatever speed they have there. And so those are equal, meaning then that V3 is going to be equal to, looks like it's going to be big M over big M plus little m times V2. And since V2 is equal to this, that means uh, their speed just after they meet is going to be V3 equals big M over big M plus little m times square root of two little g big H. Okay, uh, what is the maximum value of H for which this plan will work? So this is at state four and the maximum little h, I'm sorry, maximum value, minimum, wait a minute. No, maximum value of little h. Okay, I'm just reading the problem again. Minimum, okay, stop. Breathe. Okay, maximum little h for this will work is the little h that gets him to the top, or the little h he can reach and be motionless at the very top. So potential energy there is big M G little h, and kinetic energy is zero. So uh, let's see. That means we also need the uh, the kinetic energy at three. So at three, potential energy is zero and kinetic energy is one half. And remember, this is the Tarzan plus chug chug mass now that's going through all this times V3 squared, uh, which is equal to one half, uh, so let's see, big M plus little m, and then V3 is big M over big M plus little m squared squared, and then times two G H. Uh, so let's see. So the twos are going to cancel there. So you're going to get that kinetic energy 
uh, and three is going to be, let's see, the big M plus little m here will also cancel one of these. So it's going to be m squared over big M plus little m times little g times h. Mm -hmm. Hold on, little g times big H. Okay, and then that has to be equal to this because of mechanical energy conservation. So Emac three equals Emac four. Sorry, I know this is totally scattershot, but eh, whatever. Okay, that means that uh, the mechanical energy here is zero for potential, and then this. So big M squared over. Oh, whoops. Totally wrong here. Sorry, potential energy here for four should be big M plus little m times GH. Okay. So anyway, M squared over big M plus little m G big H, which is your mechanical energy three, which is all kinetic. And then your mechanical energy four is all potential. Big M plus little m times little g times little h. So G's are going to cancel out. And what you're going to get, this is going to go underneath. So you're going to get little h equals big M squared over big M plus little m squared. Okay, and it works out, oh, sorry, times big H. There we go. And that works out dimensionally, so that's good. This, by the way, was a uh, physics test problem at Rice, which was my alma mater in like 2005 or six or something, uh, which was sometime after I graduated, like 10 years after I graduated. Uh, the only differences are that there were three more parts to the problem. Uh, you had to find the maximum tension in the vine. I think probably you had to find the tension in the vine right before Tarzan grabbed Chug Chug and right afterwards, and then you had to find what's the maximum tension the vine has to withstand. So they had that too. But uh, but yeah, it's it's you know, you're doing college physics, people.